Sketch. This video will tell you how to use your Chromebook to take photos and then how to crop them. Many of you have Chromebooks and that's the only camera you might have access to to be able to take pictures of stuff. So for art class, I'm going to show you how to take a picture with your Chromebook. So I will move this a little closer so you can see. Now on the Chromebook, there's a little circle down here and that is going to help. That will show you um, the different little apps that you can use. So if you press your circle, click on it and it'll pop up. And you can either write camera in here in the search bar. It's C A M E R A. Oh, and you can see when you type it in, it just pops up for you. So you're going to click on that little camera, and that should bring up this screen. Now, this is your, if you want to make it a little easier, any web page you go to or anything that pops up on your Chromebook, usually up here in the corner, you'll see a little option. There's like a, a square, you can make it bigger. So the camera for the Chromebooks is right here. You see how my finger can cover it? Now that's what you have to point at your, your artwork. And to take a picture, you can press this button. This is the space bar button. Or you can press this button. This is the enter button. Or if you're really coordinated, which I'm not all the time, I get my mouse and I scroll over here. This circle is like the button that you press to take a picture. So I'm going to turn it around here. And I'm going to have to get in a real awkward position, but I'm going to try to hold. And I will snap a picture with that space bar because that's my favorite way to do it. And while you're pressing the space bar or the return button or whatever, you'll hear a noise like this. Listen. You hear that little? And that means that you captured your picture. To find the picture that you just took, you'll click on the little circle that's at the bottom right hand corner. Now you can take a look at the pictures that you took. And if you have a lot of extra stuff in the picture that you don't like, like I didn't want that, my arm in the picture and all that garbage, I'm going to show you a trick called cropping, where you can cut out the, the part you don't like. If I click on it, see that, that way nothing's up there. If you click on it, you'll be able to press this little pencil. You see the little pencil here? And that makes you be able to change it a little bit. Now there's ways that we can make our picture better. Now I'm going to show you the best one, which is crop. Crop is this button here. So what is cropping? Cropping's like magic. Do you see this, the rectangle in the middle that's brighter? That's the only part that you're going to keep. And everything else is going to get chopped out of your picture. Click on those little circles on the edge of the rectangle with your mouse and you push down and then you slide your other finger across the mouse pad to drag those edges and whatever is lighter colored is the part you're going to keep and everything else will be cut out of the picture. And if you missed some that you thought was important you can Click on that little corner circle again and drag it out. Okay. And when you're satisfied, you press done. And it saves it in your pictures. The final step is coming up next in the next video, how to share your art in the Google Classroom.